Welcome to Trail Recon. This video is a compilation of clips I have filmed over the years from one specific obstacle on Valley of the Moons Trail here in Southern California. This is not an endorsement of any specific tire, but I think the results are very interesting. First up is some footage from my Jeep back in January of 2017, and I'm running 35 inch Cooper STT Pros on a 2.5 inch Terraflex budget boost. And you can see I make pretty easy work of this obstacle. This next clip is my Jeep back in February of 2019 where I was running a 37 inch BFG All Terrains and a 3.5 inch rock crawler lift kit. And special thanks to Brittany from Lightbright for filming this. You can see these All Terrains were working really hard to find grip. Ooh, that wind. And here is my current setup as of June 2019 where I'm running 37 inch Cooper STT Pros and a 4.5 inch Icon Vehicle Dynamics lift kit. Easy day up this obstacle. Now I'll just share a few other Jeeps on the same obstacle that I filmed over the years, starting with my good friend Marco who's running 38 inch Milestar Patagonia. Too easy, too easy. And this is a clip of my buddy Joe from back in 2017 who was running 37 inch BFG mud terrains. Up next is my good friend Chappie and he's running 37 inch BFG all terrains. You can see once again the all terrains are having a hard time getting up this obstacle. John, who's running Cooper STT Pros, also in a 37 inch tire, making easy work of this obstacle. And last up is a set of 37 inch Nitto Trail Grapplers. Once again, some mud terrains making this obstacle look easy. Now it's important to mention that there are many factors that can be considered in each of the video clips that you just watched yes. like tire pressure, throttle control, the line chosen, vehicle weight, and many more. But I can say the increased off-road performance results I have noticed switching from the all-terrain back to a mud-terrain tire these past few months has really been significant. Now don't get me wrong, I've tackled some great trails running all-terrains on my Jeep but there have been plenty of times where I have wanted for a bit more traction. And there are pros and cons for running each type of tire, but to get the best off-road performance, I'll personally be sticking with an MT. I hope you found this video interesting. Thanks for watching.